frozen remains of a Swiss couple who went missing 75 years ago in the Alps have been found on a shrinking glacier. It's missing a limb, it had a sort of a dark greyish skin color. Now there's the discovery in Russia of a full woolly mammoth apparently with the blood still intact. So what does that mean? possibility to look back into our past. There is actually nothing that can't be frozen excluding time. Animals and troops who are time trapped. Some effects of ice are tiny living things and big ships. Put on your coat because we're going to go to the world of ice. Frozen remains have been found on a shrinking glacier. The frozen remains were found on a glacier that is melting. You can't imagine what the mountaineers found buried in the snow during a cleaning drive on Chandra Peak. As they were doing their work, they came across the remains of Indian Air Force personnel who had gone missing about 50 years ago, along with those of 98 other Army personnel. The ice had hidden them in the snow for almost 50 years before it finally melted. Ship. Remains of an old ship, the Endurance Shipwreck, as its name suggests, has been found whole. We have beautiful footage of the wreck and interviews with some of the people who found it. In 1912, explorer Ernest Shackleton set sail on the boat Endurance on an Antarctic expedition. It was never seen again until 2022, when it hit the thick ice of Antarctica while cruising and sank. It's like all my life has been coming together. It was easy to see everything on the boat, including the hatchways, stairs, fixings, and fittings. Both the name, metal, and the star marking were still there. The wreck site became a historic site that is protected by the Antarctica Treaty in 1921. The flight that got lost. Researchers made an amazing discovery in October 2002. The frozen remains of a Sada Airlines flight that had disappeared 40 years before were found 660 feet below the peak of Ecuador's Chimorazo volcano. The bodies and personal items from the passengers, including ID cards and newspapers from that year, had been lost for 40 years. Unearthed aviation investigators confirmed the find, which shed light on the tragic fate of the passengers who died in the crash. The discovery provided a somber glimpse into a decades-old mystery, giving families peace and giving new information about what happened to the plane. Ian and Dana The extinct Ice Age lion cubs, named Oon and Tina, were found frozen along Russia's Semulyak River. They are thought to be 12,000 years old but they could be older. Their whiskers, fur, and soft tissues were all still there, and they probably died in a landslide when they were only one or two months old, buried under layers of ice and mud. They were bigger than modern African lions, and their perfect preservation gives us a chance to learn more about how they behaved. Head of a horse. History has shown many times that ice is the best and most natural way to preserve things. With global warming in effect, researchers found a horse skull in Upland County, Norway, in 2016. The skull was perfectly preserved and had no damage to the structure. It's not the only thing that has been found in the county. Since 2006, field work has been done from August to September every year. the woolly rhino. At the end of 2020, Russian scientists found the well-preserved remains of an ancient mother rhinoceros called a woolly rhinoceros in the diamond-producing region of Yakuza in Siberia. The body was more than 25,000 years old, and most of its organs were still in good shape. The only part that wasn't was the rhinoceros's horn, which, according to paleontologists, breaks down quickly. This discovery was quite shocking. Moose in pain. 
A local man saw this poor moose drowning in freezing water and jumped in to save it. He grabbed his axe and started breaking the ice, making a way out of the water. The moose can be seen in wild despair as he keeps moving his legs to keep from drowning. After hours of breaking ice and making paths, the moose was able to swim out of the water. You know, it warms my heart that people like this guy are still around. Fish that is frozen. Because the water is so shallow, it's a miracle that these fish didn't get completely trapped under the ice. In 2020, a man was skiing on a frozen river when he saw several fish trapped under the ice, struggling to get free. He quickly got a claw hammer and began breaking the ice, which caused the fish to start to wiggle and possibly break free. In just a minute, the fish were free. Frozen catch twice. Things were the same in the ice as they are now. Oh my god. What these guys found the fish that was frozen in the lake wasn't just frozen. It was caught while feeding. The eyes carved a hole around the fish to get them out. But what they saw was amazing. The fish weren't just stuck in the ice block. They were stuck together as a pair. And the trout even had another smaller trout in its mouth. The cold weather got in the way of the trout's dinner. And just when it was about to enjoy a good meal, fate got in the way. Dolphins who got caught. Animals that are jolly good, they were forgiven by nature this time, but not as much. Dolphins were trapped in the ice off the coast of New Finland. When concerned citizens heard about the distressed dolphins, they rushed to the scene of the crime to help. This is a great example of community involvement and unity. Many dolphins were trapped, and thanks to everyone's hard work, 12 were saved. It was too late for the others. There is a zombie virus. Witness the horrors of what one virus can do. The researchers who have revived a number of these zombie viruses. Researchers who have brought a number of these zombie viruses back to life say that this is by far the scariest thing that has ever been found under the ice. French scientists have found and brought back to life a 48,500 year old zombie virus that had been frozen in a lake in Siberian permafrost. The virus, called Pyrus sibericum, is thought to be the most deadly virus ever found. Things the Vikings owned. People are happy when they find small things like Viking swords, weapons, and skis. That is, until they realize how close they are when they find a mitten from the same time period as the archaeologists' mission. They found a mitten in the ice and were able to tell it belonged to a left hand by the position of the thumb finger. This small find has made them hope they will find more. A Clydesdale In 2019, two horses tried to escape from the Quiet Valley Living Historical Farm. But their escape ended tragically when they tripped and fell into a lake in Hamilton Township, Pennsylvania. Firefighters were called to save Gunther and Wilhelm, but because they were so big, a trench had to be cut in the ice to make room for them. Once the horses were safe, animal lovers and veterinarians rushed to the scene to greet and help the Clydesdales. goat in very cold water. There were two deer hunters in the area who saw a helpless goat fall into freezing water and decided to go save it. To get to the young goat, the hunters had to cross up to a half mile of ice in a boat. The ice was thin enough for the goat to fall through, but thick enough for the boat to get through, so one of them had to kick it to break it. Free to get to the goat, the goat was picked up and held in place by its horns before being put in the boat and taken to boot camp to stay warm. As soon as the goat regained its strength, it ran back against the mountain.
fox in the snow. A tragic event happened in the German city of Fingen when a fox accidentally fell into the fast freezing Danube River while hunting. The fox went too far out onto the icy surface, which killed it as it plunged into the freezing water, struggling to stay afloat. The freezing temperatures killed it. Residents found the fox and had to use a chainsaw to free it from the ice, but bystanders couldn't help because it was too dangerous. The ice stays. In 2017, a melting glacier in Switzerland revealed the long buried bodies of the Dumoulin siblings' parents. The couple had been missing for 75 years after milking cows in the meadow, and it was thought that they may have fallen into a crack and been there until the glacier retreated. Retreat brought their bodies to light, and as soon as the police found them, they quickly called their daughter to help them. Finding their parents' bodies brought comfort to everyone involved in the story, who felt a range of feelings. Getting off the ice. This wasn't a dummy or bird prop being trapped by ice. These were real birds that were about to die. The person who recorded the video showed him reaching out to help the poor birds get free, which they probably wouldn't have been able to do otherwise. These birds were in terrible shape because of the harsh cold weather. Their feathers were sticking together and crystallizing, and their bodies were also freezing. They were even having trouble walking. Five thousand years old. Hikers found the preserved Iceman in the Alps on December 19, 1991. He was three 210 meters above sea level and had been frozen in time with his left arm twisted under his body. His skin was still stuck to his bones. Genetic testing showed he was five feet tall and probably weighed 50 kilograms when he was in his mid to 40s. Researchers were shocked to learn that O.T. lived 5,000 300 years ago, which is almost a thousand years before the Great Pyramids were built. His remarkably well-preserved remains offer a fascinating look into ancient history. Before luck. Sadly, saving some people is just a lucky catch. To save others, you have to go above and beyond. A deer that got stuck in the ice was just sitting there until boat riders came along and saved him. This wolf, on the other hand, was found in a much worse situation. The locals worked together to save the dog's life. As the wolf was dragged out of the frozen lake, he seemed unconscious. The people in the area tried to help it get back on its feet, but in the end, they had to take it to the vet. After a lot of therapy, the wolf finally got better and was able to walk again. Iron Age. It's not a surprise that people in the past fought wars and used iron weapons. But what if the finest iron knives from the Iron Age were found in an opal stony ice patch? Check out its interesting features. A scientist working on a glacier archaeology program found another weapon in a melting ice patch in Yenem, Norway. This time, it was an arrow. The Vikings probably used this arrow in a famous battle. <laughs> 